welcome to Ecovacs Technical Support. Uh, today we have here Osmo 950 and there are actually there are many customers that are asking about this, uh, about Osmo 950 model, that how we can confirm whether this one is uh, the battery issue or the motherboard issue. Because uh, they say that uh, the board cannot charge. So how we can confirm whether this one is a battery issue or the mainboard need to replace because they want to order that part, maybe they want to fix themselves at home, service center is not available in this country, that is the reason that's why they're asking. So okay, I let you know the simple thing. You attach your debot with your mobile app. First thing, and the other thing is you put the debot. Make sure the power button is on. Power button on from here and attach with the charger, and put it there for three to four hours. After three to four hours, you see in your mobile app whether the charging power, I mean that one, is increasing or not. The charging bar, the battery bar, is increasing or not. If you put there for charging and uh, in the starting you see that that one is a 5% or 7% so after 3 hours you see whether that one increased to 20, 30, 40% like this or not. If it's totally not increasing and after 3 hours still showing 5% or 6% like that or 1% only increase that is 100% confirm is a motherboard need to replace in this case. But if your battery can charge and can uh, go up around 50, 60, 70 percent like this. Still, your motherboard is can charge, will be okay. So, and the other thing is uh, after that, uh, you run the D board and see if the battery suddenly going there and then suddenly shut down, or maybe after 20 minutes suddenly shut down and it didn't give any message, any error or anything showing in your mobile app. It means that it's just only the battery. You should just replace the battery because the battery suddenly shut down means that the battery is faulty. So like this we can confirm whether it's a motherboard issue or the battery issue. So hopefully you will understand uh, these two points that if totally not increasing the battery bar, it means that it's a motherboard issue. If the, that one is increasing and the debot can charge also, but the debot runtime is very short or after a few minutes it just show that the battery is low and return back to charge every time after 20 minutes return back to charging dock. This is confirmed 100% is a battery issue. Or if the debot suddenly working, working, working and suddenly shut down at one place and didn't give any message, any error, that one also is a battery issue. So these are the two, three steps we need to, uh, I mean, check and after that we can confirm whether this one is a battery issue or the motherboard issue. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you very much.